So, let's say you're an AR-15 owner and you got caught by surprise by the ATF's proposed ban of SS-109 and you have 20 rounds of ammunition. You were planning to buy it, but you never got around to it. Now you're in the market for 500 rounds of ammunition. Doesn't matter the brand, doesn't matter the cost. Let's see what your options are. I'm on the Sportsman Guide website right now. So far, your only option is PMC, 120 rounds. That's $63. Everything else is out of stock. This one's currently on back order. Everything is out of stock. It's never like this. Well, there's more PMC 200 round battle pack. It's $93, 97 if you're not a member. Two two three is just go flying off the shelves, guys. It's all out of stock. Now I'm on Midway USA's website checking out their supply of 5.56. Unfortunately, it's not much better. Pretty much everything's out of stock. And anything that is in stock, the price is jacked way up. For example, here's a thousand rounds of 5.56 SS109. It's $550 now. There's some independence. That's a f that's not a bad price, and it's still in stock. So that's one thing you could get. I have shot some of that. Seems to be pretty decent ammunition. But that's the only two that are in stock on their whole website. It's not looking good. Now I'm on Cheaper Than Dirt's website, and I'm gonna end it on a good note. They do have ammunition, but the price has jacked up a little bit. Here's a thousand rounds of Tula. It's still not a bad price. It's two hundred and seventy-nine dollars for a thousand rounds of steel case ammunition, and they do have a lot of ammunition in stock, but they didn't yesterday. They just got a shipment and updated their website. I don't know how long it's going to last. Probably not too long. Let's go through their pages. They definitely have a lot of ammunition in stock though. But that thousand rounds of Tula, that was like $279 I think it was. And here is a magazine I got from them about a month ago before all this started and it was $222. So they did jack up the price but it's still not too bad for a thousand rounds of ammunition. Okay, so now I'm on the Sportsman Guide website again, checking out the hand loading supplies for 223. There's a thousand rounds of 223. It's out of stock, currently on back order. There's brass for 223. It's also out of stock and on back order. Go down, there's, there's some more 223, and it's 250 rounds there on back order. Basically, cannot get 223. It's out of stock pretty much everywhere except for cheaper than dirt. So like I was saying in my last video guys, gun owners across America need to come together in opposition to this proposed SS-109 ban. I want everyone to email the ATF, sign the petitions, and also donate $10 to NRIOA or more. Donate a little bit, everything helps. I was just at Walmart the other day as well and they were completely out of 223. They're not a single round and they don't know when it's coming in I was asking the people they weren't a whole lot of help so they said it comes in when it comes in so pretty much 223 is looking pretty hard to get so maybe the 300 the people who bought 300 blackouts were, are better off after all I mean it's more expensive but the ammo is available so thanks for watching